ain't nothing like you, 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 or you. Uh. Hey, Tom, I'm excited for the new Nicki Minaj album in literally two days. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome to Vlogmas Week 2. So, it's currently Wednesday. It's actually December 6th, and my house is a mess right now. I literally have so much garbage and so much stuff to clean. I've just been so busy the last five days. Like, I haven't vlogged at all yet in December because I've been cramped in this house, either sitting on the couch or upstairs on my desk. I had like this huge assignment that's due today. I still have to hand it in. I haven't handed it in yet. I mean, so that's why I haven't really been vlogging that much. Um, and also the reason why I didn't post a vlog last week. I'm gonna try to vlog every single day even though I've already kind of failed at that. But we're just gonna ignore that because you guys know I am in school and it's pretty busy. Um, so, so it's the 6th today and it's gonna be really busy because I'm actually leaving tomorrow for Jersey. Not New Jersey. I would love to go to New Jersey and see like where Jersey Shore was filmed and all that because I used to watch that like when I was in high school and stuff. Um, my arm's really hurting. Hold up. So yeah, I'm um, going to Jersey tomorrow with school, which is really cool. I never thought I'd go to Jersey. It's like this little island. I don't know if it's owned by England or if it's its own little thing, but it's an island called Jersey and it's just off the coast of France. It's like an hour and a half flight from Manchester. So we're going tomorrow. I'm going to be there for a whole week. And we're gonna be like chilling at this place called Durrell Zoo. I don't know if you guys ever heard of Gerard, Gerard, Gerard Durrell. I don't know how to say his name properly. I don't really know who he is, but apparently he was a famous conservationist. And that's like his legacy is the zoo. So we're spending all week there. We're gonna go to lectures and be behind the scenes at the zoo, which is gonna be really cool. I don't know how much of it I'll be able to film, so... I will try my best to get a lot of footage for you guys. I'm gonna bring my camera. I have to do some packing and then we gotta drop off Carlin waffles at the boarding place. Before I do anything though, I'm gonna eat my advent calendar. So I bought this one, which is from Hotel Chocolate. It's the Snow Good advent calendar, which is vegan. It has 45% nut milk chocolate. I've already started to eat it. I'm sorry. I was gonna wait until I started vlogging, but it was just too hard to resist. Let's have number six. Where is it? Where are you? Oh, here it is. Aw, a little snowman. I'll stop being weird now. What time is it? We gotta go. Are you ready to go, handsome? What are you doing? Oh, you better. You're not gonna wanna come out. You're gonna be gone for four days or eight days. I think I'm gone for. I'll be gone for eight days, handsome. So yeah. Um, just trying to think what else I can update you guys on. Nope, just school. Just school. Okay. So I'm gonna just quickly put on my shoes and then we're gonna go. Look how cute like the Christmas lights look like reflecting on that. Okay, tell me why. I just fixed it now, but tell me why the Laura Mercier translucent powder goes yellow on my skin. Also, if you notice that my skin was yellow, there we go. It's gone now. <laughs> we're going. <gasps> look how pretty you are, Carl. You're so pretty. Are you gonna go to boarding for a couple days? Are you gonna be a good boy? Ready? Dun, dun, dun. Good job, Carl. I just need that tail. <coughs> okay, I'll leave you right here for a second. I'm gonna just put on my shoes. Okay, so I just got to the reptile boarding place and I'm so sad. Carl, how'd you hold up in there? Where are you? Oh, he's in the back. He was holding on for dear life. What are you doing, handsome? Not comfortable at all. Okay, let's go inside. Oh, it's freezing. You can literally see my breath. It's so cold. Hello, Hello pretty bird. Hi, Carl. I just dropped off Carl, but I'm gonna take a little sneaky look at all the other reptiles they have here. Whoa, look at this guy, he's huge! Take a look, my 
song stuck in my head. I haven't heard that song for like years. Mm, 30 seconds. So this is my dinner for today. I made some zucchini pasta. I kind of burnt it because I was playing Dead by Daylight as I was waiting for it to cook. So, oh, and my thing's getting fuzzy. Okay, let's try. This is my favorite type of pasta. The farfalle, like the little butterfly things. Butterfly wings or ribbons. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. I am just going to finish my proposal. I really don't want to do it right now. It's like 10 o'clock at night. 9.45, but I'm so tired. I haven't even packed yet. I just finished writing. All of my ish. I did it on mangrove forest, which was really cool. Yay! <laughs> okay, so I'm just packing. I just took a shower. As you can see, my hair's all wet. Um, I'm just gonna start packing now. I have literally an hour till I have to leave, and I don't know why on earth I left it this late. I just got to Manchester Piccadilly and the train that goes to the airport doesn't leave for like 20 minutes so I'm gonna try to get breakfast somewhere because I didn't eat any breakfast. Cafe Nero! $2.55 for a bottle of water, that's crazy. Okay, I just got my panini. I got like that little festive vegan whatever it's called, and I'm just going to the train. I'm going to platform 13 to go to Manchester Airport. So I'm just in this restaurant. I'm just waiting for all of my to arrive but I came here really early because like all the trains were cancelled so it was either I got here at 10 or I got here really late what <laughs> got myself a cider this is my first drink in August September October November December six months wow I'm gonna just like edit my YouTube video while I'm waiting. I don't know where everyone went, to be honest. I don't think anybody would have wanted a drink. because like there was only two rooms where someone could be on their own so one of them went to the teacher there was one room left and i was just like well if no one's gonna take it i'll take it <laughs> and so now i have a room of my own uh, i'm so happy and then we're just about to go out to eat some food we're gonna go get some thai food i think and then we have our first day tomorrow like so far jersey has been pretty interesting it's apparently not part of the uk i got a text on my phone that says you are now in Europe zone B, so you are gonna have to pay £2.25 to make calls and texts. So like the taxi driver when we were driving here was like explaining all these different things. It's part of the British Isles, so technically like it's not England, but they get British passports. I don't know, it's, it's so weird. They have their own currency. You can still pay in pounds, but they have their own currency. Oh, they're also like part 
French. They have their own language, so it's not like French French, it's Jersey French. Yeah, it'll be really interesting. This is like a place I never thought I would visit. It's never been on my radar, like, so it'll be kind of cool to see what it's like. My grandparents have never been here and they said they've always wanted to go, so I'm gonna try to film a lot so that obviously you guys can see, but also so my grandparents can see. <laughs> just got back and i'm just taking off my makeup it's around like nine o'clock oh yeah so while i'm here let me do like a little room tour so this is my room so i'm by myself i love interacting with people but like i really do need time to recharge anyways so i'll do a really quick room tour so this is the bathroom i just think this looks like such a british shower this is what a british shower looks like oh how do you turn this on I don't really know how that works. That's gonna be hard. Oh, oh, okay, I got it. You twist it and then you move that. I have a cool little light here to make it move like nicer. I got these, by the way, because I did. Oops. Oh, I should have bought some water bottles. Totally forgot about that. And then we come out here. And it's just a big old vintage looking bedroom. Kind of like giving me scary vibes. Like, I don't know what's in here. I think I should just check this now. I'm really scared actually. <laughs> oh, what's in here? Da, da, da. Oh, so it's a closet. Okay. What's in here? Oh, there's a safe. I have some more storage in here. Tell me, does anybody actually use these? I've never in my life used hotel room storage. I feel like I probably would if I was staying for like a while. But I always just feel like if I use it, I'm going to forget that I've put the thing in there, if you know what I mean. I'm going to go start editing my video or go to bed and wake up early and edit my video. But I'm really excited because Nicki Minaj's album comes out tomorrow. And I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I just realized I got a TV. Doesn't look promising to me. <laughs> um, oh, something's happening. Never mind, Family Guy's on, so I'm putting on Family Guy, and now I'm editing my video. I'm gonna try to finish it tonight and get up for you guys for tomorrow. Good morning guys, it's currently 4 a.m. I've been up since 2.40, I couldn't fall asleep. So I'm just gonna get up and start working on my video. Okay everyone, stop what, we're, stop what you're doing right now. Stop, okay. It is 5 a.m. <laughs> Nicki Minaj's album just came out. I'm gonna give it a listen. I'm not gonna be playing it because i don't want to wake people up and i really want to vibe to the music so wait where is it holy shit okay i just went through the whole album it's now 6 a.m in the morning oh uh, tell me why i'm getting like a little bit emotional <laughs> i've been her fan since 2009 i remember like the come out for pink friday and like it's so crazy i love the music so much it's so good <laughs> i'm gonna be playing it I'm, I'm not even gonna play any other music from here on i'm just gonna be replaying that album i'm actually crying Dude, literally the best album Nicki minaj has ever put out if you have not listened to it yet you're gonna freaking love it my favorite songs right now is everybody big difference and beep beep i'm in such a good mood now i was literally dancing like crazy like even once i turned off my phone like i had a little workout like i was just dancing like it was no one's business so we have to meet up to go to the zoo at 8 15 so while i was listening to the music i already had my breakfast and I'm just gonna get ready. It's probably gonna take me a while to get ready, but I'm gonna edit for like a little bit longer and then I'll get I'll start getting ready at like seven or something. Okay, I just finished getting ready. This is my makeup today. I completely forgot to bring my conditioner and shampoo, so I gotta go get some today. Anyways, I'm late. Let's go. I'm in such a good mood. I've been listening to Nicki Minaj all morning. Okay. <laughs>
I literally went to the cafe and now it's like pouring absolute buckets. So I'm gonna try to run. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my god! <sighs> oh my god, my phone's gonna get so wet. Currently 6.30, you literally couldn't have a nicer night than this. Watching Crocodile Dundee while I eat some pizza from Domino's. Mmm. Mmm. That should be good. I feel like this is the biggest brand ad for NYX Epic Ink Liner because I only were able to buy these, which are like the simple cleansing wipes because normally I use like this makeup remover, this oil stuff, and it gets rid of all my eye makeup. But like this stuff is literally stuck. This is This was from two days ago and it's still here because I can't remove it with my makeup wipes because I don't want to like rub my eye, you know what I mean? So the next Epic Ink Liner, if you leave it, it's waterproof and it does not move. So this is going to be my makeup look for the next couple days. sorry i have not really been talking to you guys the last couple of days it's been so busy last night i was up until 4 a.m 4 15 to be exact working on a presentation that we had to do today at 9 a.m so i am so exhausted it's 5 15 and we got back like an hour ago to the hotel and i just literally Feel like falling asleep but it's the last night today so we all sort of have to go out i mean i don't have to it'd be weird if i didn't go so we're gonna go and eat like pizzas and stuff but yeah we're leaving tomorrow this has been a pretty crazy trip i'll fill you guys in because my battery or sorry my memory on my phone is like really bad but before i stop talking i want to show you what i bought at the thrift store if you guys ever come to jersey and you go to the jersey zoo their thrift store is one of the nicest thrift stores i think it's because everyone here is like rich <laughs> but let me show you i bought this jacket hold on yes i changed into my pajamas because i wanted to get cozy but First of all, I got this book for two pounds. It's Gerard Durrell's book. This is apparently his famous book that he made. Uh, he's made a lot of books, but this is like his most famous book. So I thought, what the heck, why not? I'm here, it can be like a little souvenir. So I got it. If you don't know, he's like the guy that made the zoo. Like he's the one that founded it. So this is like his adventure growing up and stuff. I look so tired. Oh, almost dropped it. Okay, and then watch this. Watch this. In the comments below, let me know how much you think this was. 
how how much do you think this was? This brand new jacket. It was eight freaking pounds. Eight pounds! It's brand new. It doesn't even look like it's ever been worn. It's like not dirty or anything, so I'm so happy with that. But anyways, I'm not gonna do my makeup. I'm just gonna leave it like this because I'm just too tired. But I'm gonna just quickly get ready and then we're gonna go out to eat and stuff and then we're leaving tomorrow at 6 45 a.m It's crazy. It's already been a week. I feel like I haven't really vlogged. I feel like I haven't uh, but let's, let's go. So we're just at dinner. Here's my friend So. We're waiting for pizza <laughs> Hi room. Let's go. Good morning. It is currently Saturday and I forgot to put on my microphone. One second. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Okay, that's a lot better. Good morning, everybody. It is currently Saturday. I didn't vlog anything yesterday because I was sleeping the entire freaking day. Like, we got back at around 10.30 in the morning, like on our flight. We got back 10.30 a.m. Had to wait a little bit because my train didn't leave until 12.30. And let me tell you, when I got home, I think I got home from the train around like 1.30 p.m. I got home. I went on the couch and I took a nap until like 3.30, went out, grabbed some ingredients for dinner and then I got back, made dinner, watched a little bit of TV because Single Infernos season 3 just came out which is such a good show on Netflix, I really urge you guys to watch it, uh, it's like a dating show. I was watching it and then I think around 7.30 I fell asleep again, woke up at 5.30, I was up for like maybe an hour and then I fell asleep again until 9 so I have been non-stop sleeping <laughs> but now I'm home and I gotta go get Carl and Waffles I gotta go get some food I gotta go get them some food and I need to clean my house because I left it in such a state that it's actually stressing me out like look at this look at this table just like have all these things I have like my hair dry and stuff on the floor like all this stuff in the back like it's so bad so we got to do some really good cleaning today and i think today is going to be the last day that i'm going to vlog for this vlog so i'm going to like cut it short so i can start another vlog tomorrow so yeah so before i head out i just want to say like i enjoyed that trip a lot even though it was really intense there were just so many moments during this trip that i just felt like so happy to be alive like i just felt very grateful because I was surrounded by such beautiful people like everyone in my program are just such beautiful people like I genuinely like everyone um, you know and like just having the opportunity to be in this master's program and go on such a trip like that where we go to an actual zoo like Jarrell which has made such an impact on the world learn from them like it was just a really really pinch me moment really grateful and some of the places that we went to like um the last one i don't know what it's called but it was full of sand dunes and it just reminded me of this trip that i went on my euro trip back when i was in high school with like my best friend and stuff because we went to like the beaches that had like those type of sand dunes and stuff and just reminded me of france and it just made me realize too, like, I sometimes forget that I'm living in Europe. This used to be an exotic place for you to go, and now look, you're only flying an hour to go somewhere like that. And it was just a really big pinch me moment. So even though the trip was exhausting, I just learned so much, and I'm just so grateful and just really happy. And yeah, that was that. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I didn't really vlog, like, a lot when I was there. I tried my absolute best. But I couldn't bring this camera because I didn't even have enough room in my luggage. I still gotta unpack my luggage and everything, so we're gonna do that. But first, um, before I head out, I'm gonna have my advent calendar because I have eight days that I missed. Yeah, eight days. How sad is it that this is turned off? Carl, we're coming for you. And waffles. Okay, so we left on the 6th. We have 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Is it the 16th today? Damn, I have 10 to eat. Hurry 
Barbie sound play. Yum. Number eight. Oh, there it is. Why does this look like a guy from Jurassic Park? Mm, 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 mm. Oh, that even looks more like Jurassic Park. Mm. Damn. <laughs> Only eight days till Christmas? Hold up. There's only eight days till Christmas. Well, I mean, I have been away for like a week and a bit, so I obviously won't feel- I, I didn't feel Christmassy at all the last like week and a bit. I don't know. Okay, well, I'm going shopping today, so I don't know if I should go get my Christmas grocery shopping done. Like, you know, like my food and everything, or if I should maybe wait until later on in the week. Hmm. By the way, how old? When did my hair get this long? It's literally to my Chi Chi's today. What the fu- Okay, anyways, I'm ready to go. It's now one o'clock. I've eaten my advent calendars, but I think I now need to go chug a big cup of water because my throat <clears> is <throat> literally coated with chocolate. So I'm gonna just guzzle. A big thing of water. Okay, let's go. Hey, we're here. It took me so much longer than it usually does to get here. I left at 1 30. It's now 3 30 almost. There's a really bad traffic jam on the way here, so. But we're here now. We're gonna go get Carl and Wolf. Hello. What are you doing? He's so cute. Okay, so we got Carl. We got Carl and Waffles food. And let's go home. Hopefully there's not as much traffic, but we'll see. Where are we? Yay, welcome home, handsome. You've been gone for so long, haven't you? You've been gone for such a long time. I think that's the longest we've been apart from each other. I think eight days. You've never gone boarding for eight days, handsome. <laughs> okay, we'll let him chill. We'll let you chill. I'm just debating whether or not I want to go grocery shopping. It's so dark. I guess I need breakfast. So I probably should go. Okay, I'm not going to be lazy. We're gonna go. We are at Aldi. Whoop whoop. That's the of the bodies. Miss shortbread so much. I got some cranberries. And a lot of really yummy fruits. Really just to counteract all of the really unhealthy foods that I had the last week and a bit. I didn't buy a lot of stuff because I'm going to be doing another Christmas grocery shop in the next couple days. So I just bought like enough food for like maybe four days. So I didn't buy any desserts. I just bought like some veggies, got some tofu, like some fruits, stuff like that. So not a lot. <gasps> It's currently 9.50. Taking on my makeup. And I had dinner, put Carl to bed. Put Waffle to bed. <laughs> Gave him his dinner, even though he's not eating it. He doesn't look remotely interested in it, so. Anyways, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, Waffles eats a rat. I filmed it in the past, me doing that, so if you want to see what it looks like. It's one of my old vlogs, but... Yeah, it's not cute. It's kind of gross. But anyways, I'm going to end the vlog here because I think it's gone on quite a long time. I mean, at least I hope it has. And I don't have anything else I'm going to film today. <laughs> I'm just going to go to sleep. I'm actually really tired. I hope you guys enjoyed this video nonetheless. And I'll see you next week. Or 
in a couple days with another video.